What's going on guys? I'm Steve. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. If it's your first time stopping by the channel, hit that subscribe button. Trust me, you won't regret it. If you're a returning subscriber, as always, guys, welcome back and I do appreciate the support. Guys, listen, I want to talk about the person today that is a real piece of trash. This guy up here that you're looking at is 28-year-old Anthony Gray. And this is the only picture of him because there's no mugshot out right now. I couldn't find it. And uh, this story happened in Pasadena, Texas, which is right up the road from where I'm at in Houston. So I don't know if he's from Houston or pa Pasadena, but he's in the Harris County Jail. So evidently he must be he must be from Houston. But anyway, check this out. <clears throat> this guy right here, Anthony Gray, is a father of a baby, a little girl. This guy assaults the baby mama, I guess at an apartment, then felt as though he didn't care for the to take care, he didn't want to take care of the baby no more or care for the child no more. So what does he do? He takes the baby in this Texas heat and puts it out there in the trash dumpster while it's still in the car seat. The mother called and reported, you know, that he did something with the kid. Police was driving around searching and they came across a baby screaming for her life. I don't know what make men do this type of stuff, but I mean, a lot of people need to be shown the flowers, taken right out. And this guy right here, Anthony Gray, is a perfect example of that. Here's his story. We begin tonight with a Pasadena man accused of abandoning his infant daughter next to a dumpster where investigators say she was left in the heat for hours. Fortunately, she should be OK, but her father now sits behind bars. Jason Miles is live from the Harris County Jail with new details for us tonight. Jason. Hey there, guys. Yeah, this father appeared in a probable cause court for the first time this afternoon. He allegedly told someone he no longer wanted to care for his baby girl. Wearing the same Nirvana t-shirt he had on during his arrest. Good afternoon, Mr. Gray. 28-year-old Anthony Gray faced the music regarding alleged family violence charges. Then there's a felony charge of abandoning a child. In addition to allegedly assaulting his child's mother, Gray is accused of leaving his infant daughter by a motel pool in Pasadena for 15 to 20 minutes. But that's just the beginning. Then you picked up the child, walked over a thousand feet to a nearby restaurant where you allegedly left the baby inside of a dumpster enclosure. This is the dirty dumpster area in question located near Crenshaw in the Beltway. Witnesses say they saw police respond while checking the area following a 911 call from the child's mother. Left that child unattended there for three to four hours. The magistrate told Gray the disturbing information gives him a great deal of concern for the family's safety before giving Gray bonds of $100,000 on each charge against him. And again, to be clear, that baby girl is alive. I'm told she's about two months old. That's according to Pasadena police. Her father, under his bond conditions, cannot have contact with that child or the child's mother. Reporting live from the Harris County Jail downtown, Jason Miles, KHOU 11 News. All right, guys, that's the story of uh, Anthony Gray, 28-year-old dumbass. Now watch this. Say the justice system ain't shit. This woman assaulted the baby mom, gave him a $100,000 bond for that. Abandoned his child, left it in the hot Texas heat for up to four hours next to a dumpster to smell trash and scream for her life at two months old. Another $100,000. $20,000 get him out of jail. Don't you think about that? He left his baby for dead and he gave him a chance to get out of jail. How was that possible? He didn't go back and get that baby a chance at life said <clears throat> he left the baby by a pool first apartment pool 15 minutes went back thought about it oh the baby might get discovered you know what i already hate myself and i hate my baby mama i'll hurt her go back and get the baby take the baby to the trash stick it next to the dumpster 
Now, according to different reports, they say baby was in the dumpster, side of the dumpster, it don't matter. Trash is trash. And you treated your child as such. Society should treat you the same way. You should be looking at the flowers right now and not sitting in court wondering how much time you're going to get or if you're ever going to get out. Then here's the other thing with that slap on the wrist bullshit. He's ordered he cannot have any uh, contact with the child. He don't care. He showed that he cut off contact when he put the baby in the trash. Stupid logic. Stupid logic with the justice system. It's like they do the bare minimum and act like they doing something. And it has a negative effect or, or no effect at all on a person that's said punished. Look at the turnstile of people going back and forth to prison of the most craziest things where they shouldn't be out, let out in the first place or given a second chance. Especially against crimes against children and certain crimes against women and stuff like that. Come on, man. Come on. What are we doing here? They don't want to spend the money, the manpower and the research to fix some of these laws because it's profit in locking people up and letting them back out. It is. This guy sitting in court rubbing his face like he don't want to hear none of this stuff and everybody's getting on his nerves. We could solve that easy. It could have saved a lot of taxpayer dollars by just taking him outside. Boom. Get him out of here. 28 year old man. Things didn't go right between you and the baby mom. So things got to go right. Can't go right with you as a father. So that's the thing. Once you bring something into this world, that's a part of you. You'll always be the dad. Whether you're involved or not, that child always know where they come from or have a right to know where they come from. Your relationship with that girl has nothing to do with that relationship with the child. Because it said he didn't want to take, he didn't want to continue to care for the baby. So was you still with this girl or did you have parental rights to the child? If you had parental rights to the child, that makes this thing all the more worse. You know how many people out here wish they could have their children that are men? I don't know if he did or not. Don't quote me on that. But they said he felt as though he didn't want to care for the child anymore. Even if you didn't, there's other people out there that did. And for what you did, it's so supremely selfish. It's unacceptable. This guy's 28 years old. And he did all of this because he didn't want to be a dad no more. It's fun making them, but it ain't fun caring for them. Especially when you're irresponsible yourself. This right here shows a lack of self-discipline and self-respect for him and his children, child. Regardless of how you feel about that woman, that baby, half of that baby is yours. And she put her life on the line to bring that child into this world. That's a huge responsibility. And that's a debt that you have to pay as a parent, both of you. I don't know anybody out here that them raised a kid and it was profitable for them to do so under the guise of just going through having a child in their presence to where it was an easy thing. It's never easy. You didn't even get this baby a chance of life. She's two months old. I can't believe that a grown man would take his own kid, look it in the face and turn his head and walk away and not think nothing else about it. Anything could have came across that child, a homeless uh, person with sick mind, with a sick mind, a stray animal. Four hours you had that baby baking in the sun out there. Unable to get out of the seat, just sitting there baking. They need to take this dude and scalp him like the Native Americans used to do. And throw him up in the compactor. I'm Stock Market Steve for the Dynamic Reason channel. As always, like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Take care.